Well, hello, how are we doing? It's the 19th of November, 2018. A bit cold today, but anyway, I wanted to show you this. Poxy trailer has, ah, oh, look. Now that's, yeah, yeah. Hold on. Oh, that's, now that's the fiberglass under a gel coat. Unbelievable. Oh well. Yeah. So my plan is right, now that the trailers are sorted that's just bits of rubber off the uh off the rollers I think. <laughs> a little bit there maybe. Nah, still just gunge off of these. Uh, that's a bit naughty there. It's a bit naughty, you know. Poxy fucking trailer. Sorry, didn't mean to swear, but it really winds me up. Yeah. It's got to be one of these. Either that roller there or that roller there. It's been digging in to the bottom of the boat, or I mean, putting it on the trailer. Uh, can't wait till the shed's put up. Get this all sorted, as it's a bit cold to start doing that old gel coat lock. It's just so annoying, you know, you pay over three grand sterling for a trailer, poxy trailer. And it does that to the boat. Yeah, a little bit there as well. But I've already sorted at this side. I can't believe I missed it the other side. Right, so, when the old, uh, <coughs> when the shed's put up, I shall. I shall uh, get a bit of heat and uh, try, try and fix that. I have spoken to a, a local fiberglasser who's willing to come up and do it for me. But by looking at all the YouTube videos, etc., I'm pretty confident that I can do it because it's quite deep, but the other ones were more superficial. I'm just looking at the dope we dug at the moment. He's uh, chasing the crows and the magpies away from some bread that I put out. Obviously, he's never going to catch them. Are you? Yeah, dope we dug. Yeah, so he's wearing them out. Yeah. Yeah? All right, then. And I've got the coos. Looking in bewilderment, or whatever the word is, can't even talk properly. Got the coos standing there watching the dopey dug running about. Hello! Uh, normally they come right up to the fence here and uh, it's electrified that fence. Uh, Normally they come all the way up and say hello. But not today, Josephine. Let's, let's just uh, watch the dope we dug. And he's sitting there like an idiot in the wet grass. Oh well, well damp grass. Anyway. Uh, <coughs> put this up for the dugs to sit on at the moment. Well, they're sitting out here in the cold, but they love it. It's nice and warm for them. Anyway, so, got to get this gel coat sorted. I'm missing a lot of fishing. There's some great fishing at the moment, doing on the coast. You know, a cod coming in and things like that. I've only got to go three or four miles, not even that, offshore. And uh, have a good time. But it's just so frustrating, you know. Can't emphasize enough 
how much it's annoyed me. Well, you you go to these people, and this is the boat I want. This is the, the trailer that I'll have, blah, blah, blah. And you trust it. And I've had experts with me, because I'm still a bit of a novice, a newbie or whatever you want to call it. But I've had experts with me, and they've all struggled to get the boat back on the trailer. But I had it out a few days ago, well, maybe a week or so ago, and it was fine, right on and off a trailer, not a problem, so it's sorted now. But, oh my God, hindsight's a wonderful thing. If I only knew that there was a problem with where they had positioned all the rollers on the trailer. Anyway, just a little quick video. Sorry to rabbit on, but it does wind me up. Anyway, all the best. Bye-bye.